Now, as you can imagine, forecasters across the U.S. are still working to determine the path of Hurricane Dorian. Now, as for now, Floridians, though, are prepared for the worst. Right now, reporter Ryan Hughes is standing by actually live in Melbourne, Florida, with more on how everyone is getting ready. Ryan. Hey, good morning to you. A hurricane watch was issued for this part of Florida yesterday. I'll step out of the way and give you a live look right now at some of the conditions. The rain just picked up here. You can see how it's breezy in this creek along the Indian River here in Brevard County, Florida. Let's go to some video. Mandatory evacuations get underway in Brevard at 8 this morning. That applies for people in low-lying and flood-prone areas and the barrier island here as well. We're told 13 shelters will open in the county today where people can go during the storm. Sheriff Wayne Ivey posted a message on Facebook about the hurricane. Here's part of that. Right now, we just don't want anybody to panic. Um, we, you can see the storm. Uh, the great news about a hurricane is we have days to get there. And so uh, we're going to continue to monitor this storm and uh, make sure that everybody understands. Okay, so you see some of the impacts behind me right now, but we're told the more major impacts likely won't come for this area tomorrow and then on Wednesday morning. Back to you.